Hello everybody, my name is Autumn, and I'm here with One Night at Flumpty 2. This is not usually the content that I make. I usually make GD content, obviously, but I kind of want to branch out into things I like, and FNAF horror games are also up there. Uh, the Game Jolt page will be in the description if you want to download this. I'm going to be trying to play the beat the normal game, and if I do that, I might try hard boiled mode. Boy, hard boiled mode. Jesus fucking Christ. Also, don't worry, it is one <laughs> in the morning. So that's, um, great. I've already done a few attempts of the regular game. I think the furthest I got was like 4 a.m. Show up, Flumpty. Now you want to. There you go. Bird, dude. So annoying. Can Flumpty show up, please? Oh. Spam, baby. Also, yeah, the first attempt I did on... What the hell is this? But yeah, the one attempt I did on fucking recording, I beat it. Nice. Very terrifyingly close, though, but... You know. I guess I'll try to be hard-boiled mode now. Can I skip this? Okay, well, I guess hard-boiled mode time. This is fucking hard. Thank God. You're gonna be here, Flumpty. Yep. Bring the whole goddamn party. Okay, patience is 500, which is kind of terrifying, but you're almost in. You are in. This is hard as fuck. He wasn't on the camera. I looked at the camera. He wasn't fucking there. Yeah, the owl's honestly the worst part of this game. Okay, you're gonna go away quickly. Cause I'm gonna... Motherfucker. Please, I need to check on the motherfucking bird. Okay, yeah, you're fine, bird. The bird's fine. I'm not. Fucking knew it. Why did I do that? Oh my god, I'm so stupid. Okay, I need to give the. God damn it. I was actually very close that attempt. I figured out a new strat. It's called Look at More Cams. Alright, whole oh man. What's your patience? Your patience is quite a lot. And by that I mean not much at all. I'm gonna actually just permanently stay on the bird cam. Fuck me, I'm just gonna die. Cause I had so much exposure by then, it was over. Right! <laughs> America. Holy go. fuck, you said it normally. Fucking, it fucking <laughs> excuse me, Flumpty? What was that bullshittery? You're about to fucking go in again, aren't you, little bitch? How about just do it, motherfucker? Oh, bird. He actually did it, holy fuck. I'm dead. I'm probably gonna die to big, fat, fucking red, aren't I? I mean, I don't care if I do, big... Big fat fucking oh you're <laughs> I thought I clicked the button. <laughs> God, some of these jump scares are fucking actually just so good. You motherfucker! Really? That's why I hate hate having double monitor and having the game not lock lock the monitor. Hello, it's Autumn and Post here, and I'm just going to take you through my basic strategy on how I beat probably one of my easier, like, custom, it's not really a custom night, it's more just, like, difficult night, but I'm going to take you through the strategy. So the first thing I do is look at Owl and Birthday Boy, see if either of them come in my office, or attempt to. Like, the beginning, the first probably hour or so is not hard at all. It's until clown starts showing up that things get a little messy but more on that whenever he whenever we get there so how the owl works really easy just goes through the vents 
and I always, I always have the left vent sealed, and the reason is just because the cams are on the right side, so it's easier to just press the button out of cams. And how I treat Owl is, as if he disappears, like he just did, I check, I only check the right cam. If he's not there, you can just stall him out on the left side, because it takes, I think, 30-ish seconds for him to hit the wall by himself without checking cam, and that's as easy as that. Birthday, he works on a cycle of cam 6 to cam 3 to cam 7 to your office. He has two moves, or two movements in each room, so he's about six movements until he gets to your office. Um, Flumpty, he can kind of just teleport anywhere around the map, so you just have to, it's just a reaction test for Flumpty. It, it's just kind of a, if you see him, then turn the light off. For Red, he based, he's very similar to Birthday Boy, except he will uh, go to Cam 3, Cam 6, then your office. It starts Cam 1, but that doesn't really matter. Just don't look at Cam 1. <laughs> and then after that, we got the Incoming. I don't even know what char what the name of the character is, but Incoming is really easy. You just press Cancel. <laughs> and I think... Okay, the two things that make this night super difficult are the combination of the owl and your battery, because your battery depletes very quickly. If you, if you blink, it's gone. I even lose it at night, or at 5 a.m. and still recover, but you'll see that whenever it comes. Yeah, your laptop battery is really what you're working against. It's very similar to the music box in FNAF 2. But, okay. Uh, patience, it's just a timer. Look at the timer. Whenever the timer reaches zero, you flip the switch. <laughs> I don't know what else to say about it. Your exposure, I haven't covered that. Um, your exposure is space, it's not hard, it's not complicated, it's just if the bar reaches max, you die. But here's the thing, if you look at the difference between exposure in the soft-boiled mode and hard-boiled mode, it's extremely noticeable. It is so much higher scaled on hard-boiled, which the combination of that and the aggression of everybody just makes this a really hard night. But it's not the hardest thing I've done. I've done much worse. And so, okay, so let me take you through my basic, what I do throughout the night. First hour or so until the clown makes his hole is I just check cams three and six, wait for owl, wait for birthday boy. And what I do after that is once the uh, once clown makes his appearance, I just check the timer and then continue the same basic strategy. It's just looking at three cams. <laughs> Anyone can do this. It's not that bad. I believe in you. Uh, yeah, that's the basic overview of my my run. Uh, hope you enjoy. Like, sub like, subscribe, comment, do all that jazz. Thank you for watching. Oh, okay. I have to start checking this cam now. Click the right fucking cam, Jesus Christ. Okay, I have to wait for a while now. Okay, 300. That should be fine. I don't know about- oh fuck, what was patience at? Okay, okay, good to know. <sighs> Red's on a 
this way here. Big Red's gonna be here. Oh, nice. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Plumpty, for joining in on that one. Um... Yes! Oh my fucking god, I I thought I actually lost that whenever I ran out of camera battery right at 5 a.m. Holy shit! Kidnap person wins Flumpy Bumpy's game after countless citizens of New Dork uh, have been abducted by the mysterious Flumpy Bumpy to play his survival hide-and-seek game won his best of Flumpy and earned the privilege of becoming Flumpy's new best friend. Allegedly, Flumpy has constructed a skinless many-headed monster out of the corpses of his game's unfortunate past contestants. That's what red is, I'm presuming. Yay, a star. Alright, well, thank you for watching this probably really fucking short video. <laughs> uh, like I said, this isn't usual content, but thank you for watching. If you liked it, like it. If you didn't, don't watch my channel then. Um, recommend If you guys want to recommend me some games to play, that's also completely fine. Go for it. Uh, thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, do what you need to do. Uh, bye.